welcome back this uni it's sugar yeah yeah i'm coming back i'm gonna do another cup um i've been saying everybody doing these lemon cups they've been doing glitter and all that stuff i don't have that type of energy but i still just want to do the lemonade cup so i looked for a glitter background and then I bought this image off Etsy. It says, when life gives you lemons, make lemonade. Don't be a salty bitch, a sour bitch. And then there's another one I want. It says something about, when life gives you lemons, make lemonade and vodka. That's the one I meant to get, but it is what it is. We're going we gonna to see what this thing turned out like. Um, my print is off a tad, but... Like I said, I just wanted it. it. Ain't no real big deal. It's just wanted to see what it looked like. Will it look like glitter when I um put it on there? And I am using the honestly speaking sublimation paper. Yeah. Everybody, like I said, been doing this like um. Tequila salt look type thing. So we're going to find out if it works or not. So we we'll put that in the oven and we're gonna do our top. Okay, so this time we got lemon. I got these from Michaels as well over in the floral department. They're so cute. And then of course, you know, we still got the decorator fillers that look like little uh, little cubes of ice. No fresh ice. So we're gonna use those as well. We're gonna use our E6000 and our glue gun. Decided on where I'm gonna do the lemon at. Good to open it, and I have been gluing these together. I, I don't know how to um, not get glue everywhere, so that's been the biggest problem for me. Um, just, I've just been gluing. <laughs> so my glue gun is still heating up. So I'm just go ahead. And use the E6000. I don't think I'm going to do like I did the other one the other day. Um, I'll try to be a little more quick with it. The other ones, trying to get them fitting there real, real good. Let's see, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to go to the top. <laughs> I ain't never tried the other ones to see that it ever move or nothing. I've just been gluing. So let me flip the other thing right quick. I'm going to That's why you need the glue gun too. So it won't be so much work. And like I said, mine is taking forever to heat up. So put a little glue here. Let's see if we got a little heat to it now. Just a tad, but it's not really. I might have to let that one sit and dry. Drops. We'll put the top on this E6000 because it's getting everywhere. We got a couple of pieces and just 
Use the glue that weighs on my table. Got this too. It looks like salt. Got this from Michael's as well. And I'm just going to... I'm going to just try put a little around this part here. Like this E6000. I'm just going to pull them things on there. Okay, because my timer went off just then, so I just put a whole bunch of E6000 around there. And I'm just going to drop them on there like this. And hopefully they stick to it. And yeah, I'm making a mess, but I get it up. Make sure you have like a bowl or a piece of paper or something down. But <laughs> you won't be doing like I'm doing, making a mess. And I'm going to just let them things sit on here until that glue dry. You see what I was trying to do? Make it look like some salt around the rim. Putting it there where the scrub is supposed to be. So I don't want to do that. Wait. Okay. Right. Now, once again, it's just because I didn't want epoxy, but the epoxy ones are gorgeous. So if you want epoxy, they, I think they are gorgeous. I just, I don't do good with glitter on epoxy for real. So I don't want to have to do all that. And you see my my measurements then go all the way back down to the bottom. But that's fine too. But it looks good. Do it look glittery to you? Not really. <laughs> it almost went somewhere, honey. Let's see. But yeah. So we got that. From a distance, it almost looked glittery. So this is what it's supposed to look like. It's supposed to look like... Well, then maybe I should dip my lemon a different way. Let me turn my cup. My lid, I meant. Let me turn my lid. Uh, should I turn my lid like that? Or... Let me turn my lid. Do it look like salt on the rim? Well, anywho. Y'all see it. Y'all know what I was trying to do. So it doesn't matter to me. It's cute, right? So, I'm gonna have to play with it some more. And make sure ain't none of them things getting up in the part where you drink the scry yet either. It ain't dry all the way yet. Okay. Y'all have a blessed one.